maybe you're writing ad copy for yourself or you could be using the Google Ads recommendations when you're building an ad. It sometimes suggests to you certain head uh, headlines you might want to use. The problem is they often clash. So I built this tool to uh, look at the different headlines, which you might have down here on the left and where they're all pinned into place. So it's got all this data here and the descriptions over here. And then it rotates the different ad copy and descriptions for you, the different headlines, sorry. And you'll be able to see through these examples if there's any clashes. So for example, in this particular headline down the bottom here, we've got the headline which has got get the greatest underwear, greatest underwear and t-shirts and made from free range unicorn. So we probably don't want these two headlines appearing next to each other, these two here, headline one and headline two, um, they clash a little bit. So we probably want to look for some other alternatives. Maybe we don't want things like free PNP appearing in position number one up here, and maybe we don't want 50% off appearing up here. You can rotate through the different ad copy by using this drop down. and it will change over for you. And you can go back and every single time it's just gonna show you another random selection of ads based on the different headlines and the position those headlines are in. So you can see here that this headline, greatest underwear and t-shirts is in position two. So that will only appear in position two and keep everything snug will only appear in position three. And then these other ones, because they've not been pinned, they can appear anywhere. So there's a couple of formulas in the background which make this sheet work. I won't go into detail around how they work. Um, you've got access to the sheet, so you can go and have a look at these if, if you're interested in it. Um, but all you have to do is go to your Google Ads editor, copy all of your ads, and then you can just drop them straight into here. Just Control P, Control V, um, sorry, Control V, Control P, drop them into the back here and then that will automatically update the sheet for you. Um, if you want to keep a record of this, um, just make a copy of it for your own uses and you can update it as much as you want. Um, I'll make some updates to it and see if I can download all of this data automatically just using Google Scripts or something in the future so that we don't have to mess around with Google Ads Editor.